Ken Serves here with another shave video. Well, I'm gonna do an unboxing because as I had mentioned, I got a nice package from Portugal. And uh, in case you haven't guessed, it's uh, another one of my addictions. I've been wanting one of these, uh, in fact, I'm gonna open it right now. I've been wanting one of these for a while and I worked a little OT, a little overtime. So, uh, well, look at this. I figured I deserve to get myself something. So what I've got is the Samogue Owners Club Badger Brush. So very nice. Mm, doesn't smell like wet animal yet, but uh, we're gonna give that a try tonight. And with that, I'm also gonna try a razor that I, I don't think I've tried this one before. It's the, sh I might have, it's the short handled Black Beauty. Here's what the uh, long handle that I've done many videos are. And there is the short handle. You can see it's a, a lot shorter. And this is an 01, so it's a 1969 first quarter. And I've got an Astra blade in it. So we're gonna, I like these Astras. We're gonna see how it does on setting number three. I know a lot of you guys like setting five, but uh, man, sometimes it gets a little aggressive. I'm going to be using, uh, uh, let's see. Easy Blade pre-shave today, and one of my favorite uh, out of Razor Rock, uh, Tobacco 2 uh, Shave Soap, and Triple X from uh, Razor Rock. And I actually I placed an order today, and I got some of the Dead Sea Soap from Razor Rock, and one of their German 37 C or 37 slants coming. So that's in the mail, and uh, I've been. Uh, texting back and forward with uh, Joe from Razor Rock, and I really appreciate that, Joe. He gave me a, a, a discount on uh, those two items, so I really appreciate that. So I'm waiting for those to come. And a preview of an upcoming video. Uh, speaking of brushes, you know, there's the new one, as I said, but these two bad boys came. Now these are old, there we go, old Ever Ready brushes, and you can tell they're pretty doggone beat. But I'm gonna turn these guys uh, hopefully brand new. They're both badger brushes, so I've got some uh, brand new badger knots that I'm going to use, and uh, I'm going to put those... In fact, let me pause this a second. I'll show you the badger knots. A lot of extra badger knots on hand for my restorations, so I'm probably going to put on... One of them looks like it had a pretty small knot, so I'm probably going to put on some of these. Uh, brand new knots ready to go. So uh, I'll get them together for an upcoming video. But in the meantime, let me get this shave uh, set up and we'll get started. Wet my face a little bit. Just got back from work. Waiting to get some dinner going. All right, put on some of this easy, uh, easy blade pre-shave. I like the smell of that stuff. And it definitely helps. Very good. Now I'm going to take this cherry wood badger brush uh, for the first time, get it wet and see if I can get a lather going. So let me get that started. Now that whips up pretty darn good. It's got a great smell too. And this is the Razor, back to Razor, Rock, Razor Rock Tobacco 2, but I also have the Tobacco 1. And I, they don't make one of them anymore. I forget which one it is. I'm sure somebody will be able to comment and let me know. All right, let's get this started. I see the light flickering on this new uh, this new iPhone 7 because I'm putting white face on and it's trying to adjust the light. Tell you that camera works super good compared to the iPhone 6. Okay. Here we go. I knew the phone would ring, and then it disconnects the camera. Got 
got a plumber coming over, fixing some uh, leaky uh, leaky spigots in my garage for the washing machine. Man, this soap smells good and lathers good. It's my understanding that Razor Rock released two versions of that tobacco soap, version one and version two, and one sold a lot better, so they uh, kept that one. I see what you gents mean. I probably could kick this up to about five because it's a pretty mild on setting three. But that's okay because it didn't cut me. <laughs> I won a couple more autographs uh, on eBay uh, from that uh, Bond autograph dealer in uh, uh, James Bond autograph dealer in uh, Germany, and he's got autographs from Miss Money Penny, the original Lois Maxwell, to everybody. And uh, man, if you don't put those bids on like within four seconds at the close of auction, someone outbids you. But I was able to get uh, Mr. Daniel Craig his autograph now too, so now I'll have Roger Moore. I've already got Sean Connery, I've got Daniel Craig, and uh, maybe I'll do Timothy Dalton, but I don't think I'll do Lazenby, you know. That Bond movie was good, but he was just miscast. Oh, man. Very nice. I hear at the premiere of On Her Majesty's Secret Service, he showed up with long hair and a beard, and he's supposed to be James Bond, and it didn't go over well with the public, the fans, or anybody. And uh, that might have helped cost him. Uh, that's why uh, uh, Sean Connery came back from Diamonds Are Forever, so that was great. Anyhow, very good shave. Love that razor rock. And uh, that brush <laughs> worked great. No wet smell. Sometimes, you know, a badger will smell like a wet animal, but not that one. So that's fantastic. All right. Well, until next time, it's Ken Sir saying have a great night.